You look when did the hair get lopped off? Actually, uh, I just cut it off like three days ago. Yeah, I just just went on the side and just, just uh, go for a new look for right now. For right now, for right now. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, nah, I don't just, uh, like, this, I don't really think of it like that, but it's my first, I, I, I've had a haircut since 2012, I want to say, so <laughs> I'm going to see how it goes next, these, next couple months. <laughs> Returning, does this feel like your club now, like, as in, you've been to a lot of clubs, right? yeah. it's very when you return, one's had so much success, do you, do you feel more connected to the club? Yeah, I do. Uh, I mean, like, I feel more comfortable here now. Like you said, it's my second year, so, you know, last year I was a little nervous coming in, just getting to know everybody, you know, and I, I'm, not, I'm not really, a, like, a, a talkative guy, so, <laughs> you know, last year I wasn't talking at all, so this year it'd be more better, you know, I'm talking more, just talk more with my teammates, you know, just be more comfortable. Will that help to build the, the chemistry on, on court from the start of the year, then, that everyone needs to, to play well? Oh, uh, hopefully, you know what I mean, we pretty much, I almost got the same team back except like a few people, but I mean, like chemistry is there already. So, yeah. how much contact have you had with the blokes in the off season? Here and there, you know, uh, me and Bryce been talking uh, throughout the summers, but uh, I've been talking to a couple of other guys throughout the throughout the summer. You know, just seeing how they're doing. Are you excited to be back here in Perth? Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah, yep, yep, man. I'm excited. Just ready to go back to back. You know, just just uh, being a part of like the whole Perth organization. You know, everybody here is loving, fun, caring. You know, and, and I love that. Looking at last season, what what are you hoping to get out of this next season? You guys going to continue that winning momentum? We want to, hopefully, yeah. I mean, I mean, like that. I mean, that's the ultimate goal every year. So, hopefully. Have you ever gone back to back with a team? Like, obviously, went back to back individually at times. Have yeah. you had a? Have you gone back to another team after winning one and won one again? No. So, so is that the biggest challenge you can have in sport? Do you think to have the same team try to go out there and win it again? Yeah, for me, yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean if you do, uh, I mean, that that would be my first time going back to back with the same team. So yeah. Was that part of the incentive to come back? Did that make you want to, was that one of the reasons why you wanted to come back to, to try to do yeah, something yeah. you haven't done before? Yeah, of course, yeah, of course. But other than that, you know, just, you know, just being with the team, being around these, being around these guys, man, it's fun. Looking at your performance last season, have you got things you've wanted to work on in the off-season, things you want to achieve this season uh, that you maybe you didn't get to last year? Uh, you know, just pretty much showing, just showing my all-around game more this year than I did last year. You know, I mean, just, I mean, just keep being the best Tariqo I can be for the, for the team, like, like, like on and off the court. Do you reflect on your dominant final series personally and think that was really cool? <laughs> uh, yeah, but I usually just, I mean, depending on this, uh, this, how can I say? Uh, I mean, like, like within the past few years, like doing playoff time, like I just like turn my game up. Like uh, throughout the season last year, there was a lot of things being said, but I, but I, but, but I knew in the back of my head, I knew it was playoff time. Cost I mean, was playoff time start, then yeah, that'd be good. You have higher. Sorry, how do you bring that into the whole season? I thought we had a strong season last year, but finals was just a step up. How do you make that consistent for the whole season? You know, just going out there, just uh, being more comfortable. You know, like I said last year, it was my first year here. You know, I don't want to step on any toes or anything. But this year I'm coming in, everybody know my game. So, I mean, this should be better. And your on-court chemistry with Bryce seemed to really peak around those, that finals time as well. How good will that be to sort of have a year of playing alongside him under your belt going into this season? Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah, it, could be, it could be a whole lot of 2K games going on too. <laughs> I mean, I mean, like we both are like unselfish, you know. Like we don't like really have to have the ball in our hands to be dominant on the court, you know. Uh, and then off the court, you know, we, we hang out, talk, go eat, 
obviously play 2K, like, like I said. You know, so that, that I mean, so that carries over on the court as well. So, I mean, I'm looking forward to that as well this year. And you mentioned you were talking to him sort of in the off season as well, keeping that friendship going. Is it nice having him here in Burnley? Yeah, it is, of course. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. And you just cut off a fight. How are you feeling right now? I'm tired, man. You're hearing my voice. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> I'm tired, man. I ain't gonna lie. You did well. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one more. One more question. Yeah. I guess going home for that off season, do you feel refreshed? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. You know, just get things started with the team. You know, like I said, trying to go back to back this year. So I'm ready.